Uh, let's speak to a resident of Homs who joins us from there, Omar Shakir can speak to us now. Uh, Mr. Shakir, just tell me what the latest situation is on the ground where you are. Hello. Here in Homs, they are, uh, there is a non-stop shelling. You can hear uh, the voice of explosion, the, ho uh, the voice of rockets just land in one house, uh, one civilian house. Until now, there is more than uh, 50 martyrs and more than uh, 80 injuries. So when you say 50 people have died, you, 50 people have died in what space of time? In the last 24 hours or more? Uh, in the last four hours. In the last four because, hours? Because uh, Assad... Yeah, yeah, because uh, Assad militia and uh, security force shlagged three families in uh, Al Sabil neighborhood, and they are shelling Al Khalidiya, shelling uh, Al Bayada, shelling Inshaat, shelling Baba Amar with rockets, with with mortars, with um, heavy machine gun. There are reports that uh, tanks have been moving closer to residential areas in Baba Amar. Uh, have you seen anything that might verify that? Yeah, right. Uh, they are uh, coming close to break into the neighborhood. Uh, you can't see them. Uh, you can't see them uh, by your own eyes. You have to see them by maybe a camera with a good zoom. They are shelling from far away. And I have to add uh, to add something. Uh, all the city is surrounding with. Uh, tanks surrounding with uh, soldiers, security force, and uh, regime cut the uh, uh, internet, cut the phone, cell phone. There is no connection with the uh, outside world. We are using satellite now, satellite internet. Okay, and tell me one thing, uh, how all of you are preparing uh, to defend yourselves? Okay. Because uh, we are now, we are feeling that we are alone. There is no one, nobody care about us. And the UN give Bashar al-Assad to shell us by the rockets, to shell us by tanks, Russian tanks, T-72. Now we are thinking, people here start to, to think, we cannot let Bashar al-Assad kill us. We, we cannot let him just arrest us. We will defend us by every possible way. We will carry knives from the kitchen and defense ourselves. That's our right. Omar Shakir, we appreciate uh, you taking the time to talk to us as we leave Omar Shakir there to the sound of shelling in the background.